guys welcome back no drama makeup mama here we are gonna do an unboxing so this is gonna be real quick um, I did just film my luxury brand thing and you know my husband thought the right side of my face was expensive and it wasn't so I don't know what that says about me <coughs> or the companies but excuse me we'll find out today I'm unboxing my slay glam box I got it it's not really a box it's a bag I would say it comes in a mailer and then this is inside of it, so it was a little bumpety, but hopefully everything's okay. Oh, they wrapped it really well in, in bubble wrap, so. Okay, so the Slate and Lamb box, Slate, this is my first Slate and Lamb box. Um, they had a little trouble with shipping, but you know, I'm gonna give them the benefit of the doubt. This is only like their second or third box, and they've grown really fast, and I know that the company um, was run just by like a couple people. So they really had to kind of grow fast. And I know that they had a lot of issues with shipping. They were supposed to be shipped out by the 17th. And um, I just got mine today. So, and I never got like a tracking thing. I'm trying to see if there's a card in here. Yes, okay. It says, thank you for subscribing. Slay that look and share us to be featured on our, on our social media. Um, it does tell you, huh. Okay, well, something is written out. Like, they, I guess they changed products at the last minute. Um, the first thing, so this is basically a Kaylin Cosmetics box, which I don't know about. Okay, so this is the Kaylin Cosmetics Face Modeling Contour Palette. It says that this retails at $52. And it is, okay, it's a mixture of, there is a powder, and these are all creams. That's a powder and that's a cream. I've never heard of this brand. It is very heavy feeling. It says it has a primer, contour highlight, and a finishing powder. So you've got your primer, your contour and highlight, and then your finishing powder. So this is kind of, I guess this is like the, the Kat Von D's Shade and Light palette. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Okay. So the next thing I pulled out was the Steve Laurent liquid lipstick. This retails for $22 and I got the color lilac. Is this purple? I would love to get a color in a box that like I actually will keep. It would be nice. Of course I can't get it out. And I will not use this color. Okay. So yeah, it's, it's like a light it's kind of in between a pink and a purple, but it's too light. Like my lips are naturally pretty pink. So if I try to put lighter colors on it, it makes me look dead. So this will be going in a giveaway. All right, the next thing, it was supposed to be the Bella Pierre Cosmetics Clear Eyeliner. So to use the eyeliner with the powders, and it says powers, but it's supposed to be powders, from the Get the Look Kit or any pigment powder, powder to achieve any color eyeliner. So basically this is just clear eyeliner that you can use um, to create eyeliner from eyeshadows. But you can also do that with makeup remover. So, I don't know about that. All right, so the next thing in here is the Kaylin Cosmetics Contour Duo Blush. Now I'm gonna tell you like, it says this Kaylin palette was $52 and that this brush is 24. I have never heard of Kaylin Cosmetics. Now the brush feels really nice. It has one side that they're both contoured, but one side is a softer contour, but it's got bristles coming off it already. And this is more of a buffing one, and this one feels really nice. Um, so that's a nice brush, but like I literally, I've never heard of this, this brand, and like it's covered in like this weird plastic. I don't know. And I don't know about palettes that have cream products and powder products. I don't, I generally don't use powder. I mean cream. So, okay. And then the other thing I got, which is apparently $50 is the Belle Pierre Cosmetics Get the Look Eye Kit. And I got the green one. It's called Wild Forest. And so it comes with it comes with a primer and three eyeshadows. And then on the back, it kind of tells you how to prepare your eyelid. 
and it has um, the color base and everything on there. So I did just use my <laughs> lose my Mac Painterly pot, so this is nice. Um, and it comes with a brush. Actually, it comes with two brushes. Well, that's nice. So it comes with one angle brush and one eyeshadow brush. It's just a, it's a weird shape. Okay. Um, it's just an eyeshadow brush and an angle brush, but you know I love brushes, so. And then these are the colors. This is forest, and it's kind of forest colored. And then there is... That called reluctance which is like a darker green like a hunter green and then there's a lighter color and it's called discotech and it's like a pea green almost so these are nice these are just loose powder shadows um it comes with a makeup base i don't know if this is really 50 dollars worth of stuff but um the slate Land box is oh gosh i'm gonna say it wrong i think it's 25 dollars. it might be 20 i might be wrong i don't know i can't remember um, I'm really bad at that. So I'm a bad unboxer because I can never remember how much things cost or anything because I paid for it so long ago that like I just seriously don't remember how much I paid for it. But um, overall, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it because like, I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like it, it, it's, you know, the, the Bella Pierre stuff is nice. Um, I've never used Bella Pierre, so I'm excited to try it, but this lipstick color is so light. Like, I don't see, I mean, I don't know. I just, I mean, I can't use this, so that, and then I don't really like this kind of contour kit. So this will probably be going in a giveaway as well. Um, I'm sure it's great. I've never, but I've never heard of Kaylin Cosmetics. And apparently they are made in Belgium. Um... Well, it says made in the USA, but they're from Belgium. But like, my thing is, is when, this is just my, my, this is just me, me stop talking right now. When palettes don't come in boxes and have barcodes on the, stuck on the back, I don't think high end. Like, I don't think $52 when I see this. Like... For example, the one that I just opened, the, um, you know, Anastasia palettes come in a box and with the barcode and then you un you take that out. Or like this glow palette I got that was 50 some dollars. Um, it comes in a box with a barcode, but then when you take it out, it's this really sleek, nice, expensive looking and it doesn't have any. And it has a bar, it has a um, serial number stamp. Like these don't have serial numbers. I don't know. I don't know. So I'm kind of indecisive. Let me know down below how you feel. Apparently I'm just really indecisive tonight because I don't know what I feel about anything. But um, I don't know if I like it or not. Um, I mean, I basically got one thing that I'll use. So, and then a couple brushes. So I don't know. I don't know. Let me know down below. What do you think? But before then, let's all take another deep breath. Breathe it out and be still.